I grew up in New Orleans, Lower Ninth Ward. My daddy went to prison when I was two. And that's where he died. I can go. Mama didn't ever recover from that. Just drank and did crack. And any random motherfucker who didn't smack her around too bad. My nana the one who raised me. She run the Walsh Interior. We lived in a little shotgun house on Burgundy. But from the time I was 10, man, I want to rap. I was into old school freestyle rap. And I'd be kicking ass at them battles, bruh. But man, just couldn't catch a break. And nothing caught on. So, one Halloween, I come up with, who do you voodoo, bitch? Just as a motherfucking joke, you know? <laughs> Went right to the top of the hip-hop charts like a motherfucking rocket. And suddenly, I was famous. Going to the Grammys, hitting the parties. Man, I had bitches up to yin-yang. And for the first time in my life, I was making money. <laughs> Shit. I was spending it as quick as I was getting it. I thought I'd made it, you know what I'm saying? That that grave train wasn't there going in. So I did another song, and another song, and nothing hit. Nothing fucking hit. Song after song, and ain't nobody give a shit. It's been 10 years, man. And yeah, I could still get gigs, but all they want me to do is, who do you voodoo, bitch? <sighs> I used to play the big casinos in Vegas or Atlanta City. Nah, it's just Reno or Laughlin. It's a motherfucking cruise ship. So this gig here might be my last chance. I mean, there's some heavy Hollywood hitters up in there. If I could notice, yeah, I could be right back up on top there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 